Good morning, welcome to another episode of The Drive. The Drive. Hey, hey, welcome my friend to another episode of today's Drive. Dean Holland here, of course, on the way to Internet Profits HQ. What is this crazy craziness all about in the start of today's Drive? Well, I want to talk to you about getting in state, changing your frame of mind, right? Like, when you are pressured or stressed or worried or concerned or you have a lot going on or you feel overwhelmed or any kind of emotional state that you might be in, right? Any kind of negative emotional state, you've got to be able to switch that and you've got to find a trigger that can help you switch that in an instant. And what I was just sort of playing there before I kind of got into the drive was listening to some music, some like upbeat music, obviously not to everyone's taste, but I find one of the most powerful things to put you in state is sound, it's audio, it's, it can change you fast. Like, think about this, how many times did you hear a song and you say, oh my gosh, this takes me right back to that point in time, you know, right back to, oh my gosh, this takes me right back to that time in place or you know oh, I remember when I like gosh I haven't heard this for years that takes me back to this or that Do you know what I mean and so you got to find your thing that tri changes and triggers state okay another one is posture like posturing like how you're sitting like you know a lot of people if they're feeling down or anything like that you'll sit slumped and you'll be like oh. like sit up straight sit like this shoulders back head high you know, put yourself in a different frame of mind, a different state. It can help, like I say, when you've got these negative states, maybe you're even just tired, maybe you don't, maybe there is no sort of emotional, like, oh, I'm stressed or angry, or I'm frustrated or I'm overwhelmed. Maybe it's just simply you're exhausted, maybe you're tired. Maybe you're, you know, if I go back to when I was in the earlier stages of getting things going for my business, there was a time, obviously, as probably for most, nearly everyone, where you're running, juggling multiple things, meaning you've got a full-time job that you're going to, but you've also got this desire to have your online business. And so you are going to work full-time in the day, you come home, maybe you've got family, maybe you've got children. You know, I remember for me, I didn't have children, but I had a dog, which kind of similar in a way. <laughs> you know, I had a, a, a Labrador at the time, has a lot of energy. So I'd get home, I'd have to walk him, and obviously have some dinner, eat, got to give myself some energy, some food. And then I'd be sitting down around about, I don't know, 8 p.m., 8.30, 9 p.m., somewhere like that. And uh, I would then be sitting, working on my online business till like early hours of the morning a lot of times, and then getting up at six again. So I'd have, you know, most, for probably at least a few years when I was in a, a certain position, I was probably sleeping anywhere from three to six hours a night, right? I was tired all the time. But if you're working towards something, you've got to be able to switch out of that state and into like productive state, focused state, you know, dialed in, you know? And like I say, none of those states serve you, being tired, being overwhelmed, feeling lost, feeling over, overbared, feeling frustrated, all these feelings, stressed, worried, concerned, you know, anything like that, you've got to switch up and change that state. So think about that. Think about the state in which you are sitting down in, right? Not, not visual state, but like the state, the mental state, the emotional state that you're sitting down at your computer with each and every day. Is that mental state one of which is that mental state uh, a state of like, yeah, I'm gonna crush this today, I'm gonna smash my goals, I'm gonna get this to-do list done? Or is it a state of like, oh, another day. What is your emotional state? Switch it up, change it up, get more productive, get more done, get more focused, and enjoy yourself a bit more, right? So anyway, that was my message of today. I know, uh, I know being, Friday, I would normally do a recap of the week, but uh, to be quite honest, I really wanted to share about that because I think I see a lot of people that are just in the wrong state, in the wrong zone. 
But uh, with that said, I do hope you've had a good week. Have a great rest of your week. Have a good weekend. I will, of course, see you back Monday. And next week, I'm actually flying out to the US again. So I'll take you on that journey. So just so you don't miss any of it, smash that subscribe button if you're watching here on YouTube. Join the family. And I will, of course, see you on the other side of the weekend. Have a good one. Take care. Bye-bye for now.